Welcome back to another episode of uh, Body Works Gym TV. Basically what we're going to do today, obviously we're, you want to get good and warmed up and this assist machine here is probably one of the better things you can do to get your back warmed up because you want to kind of do a little stretching. There's obviously different variations of uh, hand grips, what you, what you like, there's, I mean it's, that doesn't really matter as far as, you know, you just have to get something that you want to do and calm. You're going to put your weight on here to, to counterate your body weight, which I don't usually take too much off. So. But, so basically just step on this thing and stretch out, just let your body stretch. And then I'll do a couple, couple reps to get going and then usually I'll finish with these at the end of the workout. Now as you can see, basically the main thing on this is your stretch, you want to get up you're going to get a little bit of an arch in your back and as you're pulling up you want to get your chin under you want to get the the, uh, the, the basically the top of this thing here close underneath your chin here so you kind of lean back and you want to make sure when you're coming you're coming down you're driving your elbows down and back and getting a good stretch good squeeze right here and then make sure you get a full you don't want to just do this here this is what we're doing. You want to get that full stretch down here to really stretch out the fascia for your lats and then pull back up, squeeze, same way. Now I like to say four sets of those to get warmed up and that way you can jump into something, another heavier exercise. Okay. Now as far as grip wise, it, it comes at that, that itself is uh, basically what you want to do. Reverse chin up, like you'll see a lot of them do reverse chin ups. That's what this is for. You put your hands hidden here and basically the same way. So like I say, all different variations. You can put your hands even here for straight. It's whatever you want, you know, whatever you feel comfortable with. But you got like four different options up there as far as to hit your back. I use it mostly, like I say, just to loosen up stretch. And then at the end of the workout, at the end of the workout, I may finish off with like four sets. That way I'm totally exhausted. And you know, that way, like I said, you got your, your plate exists here. If you weigh 200 pounds, most people, the average person comes in here, you know, trying to do a regular pull up's pretty hard for them. So this is what this is what this is for here. Counterweights your body weight, takes this, your body weight off, off your arms so that you can kind of you know, uh, go up and down a little bit easier, it makes it easier for you. But the, the, the key to this here is you don't want to make it so so easy that you're taking out the the exercise itself. So you kind of have to be careful. You really, you know, you want to make sure you're, you want to struggle a little bit, but you want to get, you know, good form out of them and finish them off. Because if you take too much weight up there and you're just, that thing you can actually, it, it'll lift you up itself if you use the weight. So that's what you want to stay away from. You want to use, like, get it to a point where you're doing hard 10 reps, 10 reps. And then, like I say, you'll get a lot, you'll do probably four sets of those and that way you'll get uh, something out of it. 